hello guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel today how are you guys doing my name is Varela and as usual i'm your host today on this channel um today i'm talking about how much does it really cost to give birth in brazil's private hospital because it's, it seems like there's been some kind of misunderstanding or some type of downgrading or some type of look down on brazil like brazil why is it that expensive yeah so i'm going to be discussing that in this video channel today but first off i would like to just with you guys first how are you guys doing welcome to my youtube channel as you all know my channel talks about how you can relocate to brazil how you can come study how you can birth here in brazil you can get married how you can have your kids how you can do so many things in brazil yeah that is why i'm here to help you and put you through so anyways i wanted to show you guys something fast fast before um we get into this video so i'm doing a an air review i know you guys can already see it on my screen even with the cap it's not covering it well totally so um i'm doing an air review so let's go one two So I have so many first times in my life. I have so many first times, like so many things I haven't done that general people have been doing. One of it will be dyeing my hair to any other color. Even dyeing my hair generally. I have never put dye on my hair, be it black, brown or anything. So this year, I just, you know, I've really, I saw it on Brazilian, Brazilian ladies. They always like, this orange is a very common color here yeah. and they have beautiful hair so oh god don't worry you guys will come and see it very soon they have very beautiful hair so when they put the color orange and then the coils and all those things oh god i always admire one particular girl that passes in front of my mom's store so whenever she passes i'll just purposely she already noticed me that i must say hello to her i just purposely like oi to the bay me to linda <laughs> That means that like i'm saying hello to her and that she's very beautiful and it makes her very happy because sometimes when i don't remember to say hello to her she comes to look for me in the store and say oh you didn't say hello to me this morning yeah so make somebody's day happy today or make somebody's day like what it or what looking forward to i don't know if you guys understand what i'm saying Sha. anyways compliment people when you need to that's what i'm trying to say anyways do you like this color what do you think i don't really care what people think but I, the cocoa is that i like the color i like the style what i'm just going to be doing is um gather my like let my natural air coil or something my mom doesn't like it you know <laughs> she doesn't like it she said uh i should have just dyed the tip the tip of it instead of everything but then this is what I wanted to do. Just wanted to do it. I like the color orange. I like that it didn't break my hair. I didn't lose any hair or anything. It didn't cut at all. I went to like a salon in the favela. Yeah. I tell you guys it's always cheap by there. But then I was shocked. It wasn't cheap. Oh, I don't know if it's because election, um, whatever, end of the year, whatever, I don't know. But it wasn't cheap. Ah. It was more than my expectation but then i had to do it so anyways let's get to the video guys if you like it drop a comment drop color orange love let's get right into this video come back so now let's talk about what really we need to talk about in this video the major reason why this video is being made okay so i get a lot of questions about people wanting to know um childbirth you know in brazil i don't know if at some point when i'm de i'm describing brazil i don't know if i have mistakenly mentioned that brazil or if i've given one kind of impression that brazil is one 
low life country or one country that is just there that you can just come and do anything or anyhow i don't know if i'm giving that impression or i don't know what kind of i don't know what kind of aura that might be allowing people to come and then think that anything they do they have to complain that ah, it's too expensive but then you can go to the usa and spend times two even in the nigeria or in the africa where you're coming from you spend times four and you don't nag you show it off so but that anyways that's not what we're talking about i wanted to put it out there that when i say brazil is affordable please listen well when i say brazil is affordable you have to be earning in dollars if you're earning in dollars oh, that is brazil is cheap for you when i mean cheap it means that you can get anything you want at the snap of your hands if you're earning in dollars if you're earning in reais that's the currency of brazil i mean you came here you got a job you started paying getting paid in reais is affordable if you get a good job you know you're paying your rent if you're a single person you're paying your rent or if you're a family person you're paying rent grocery run around uber boss all those things is affordable at least even if you're earning two five rent like two five reais per month three thousand five thousand is affordable you can do basic things and then save up but if you're earning in naira i'm speaking about naira specifically because i know my people in nigeria if you're earning in naira and then you have to first change your naira to dollars and then before you now get opportunity to change it to reais you cannot be on the same level with the people that are spending direct dollars or direct reais you cannot you have your money is no longer valuable it seems like some of you don't know yet in nigeria i'm not saying this thing so that maybe to spoil nigerian name or anything but that's the reality that is the reality the money is no longer valuable if you bring naira to brazil oh yeah yeah it's almost like it's almost like it might be a lot of money maybe one million two million in nigeria you can do a lot of things let me tell you one thing it won't do a lot of things here it's do basic things basic because when you change the money the exchange rate is insane so if you earn in naira and you first have to change your money to dollars before you change it to reais or you have to use black market here you know there are some people that have this black market whatever where they change it they don't usually expose themselves it's just if this person knows their contact and then you have to use them as middleman to get through the black market to exchange money you don't know them directly they don't have a store they don't have anything that you used to say oh, this person is black market like nigeria where you see all those uh, aboki no it's not like that here it's just personal business and then they don't get themselves exposed to everybody it's just one person that they know that will know one person that needs to change money and then go through that one person if you collect their number directly they will not respond and if they carry your money and go it's your business but please i want i want us to calm down calm down brazil is affordable brazil is affordable it's not for naira spenders i'm sorry to say it's not for naira spenders i needed to say that in this video because i've had two opportunities where nigerians are here and they were complaining rigorously you want to buy banana i thought you said brazil is cheap you want to buy uh, oil ah it's expensive oh. you want to buy this one ah eh. it will be expensive for you because you are not spending their money directly and you're not spending dollars you have to first change your naira to dollars before you get reais it will be expensive for you i was not talking to you people when i said brazil is cheap talking to you guys no it cannot be you guys it has to be a joke it has to be a serious joke so anyways that has been put out now let's talk about how much does it really cost 
to give birth in a private hospital in Brazil. You know, I always say that private hospital is cheap or is affordable or Brazil is affordable. I don't even think I've mentioned it before that like private hospital is affo cheap or something. So you should be expecting to pay, right? Some kind of high money because even in Nigeria, <laughs> it's not a cheap, private hospital is not cheap. People used to pray that their children should not fall sick in Nigeria. So why will you come to another person's country and then because some public is free, private who has to be free or what? Anyways, um, um, how much does it really cost to give it in private hospital? You would have between 9,000 to 30,000 reais. From 9,000 reais to 30,000 reais. If you don't have that money, you can opt for public hospitals. It's free. You know, it's crowded. Yeah, because you're not the only one that like free something. Do you get? You are coming from another man's country. You're coming from your own country to come and benefit from a country that gives their um, citizens, uh, you know, healthcare for free. So obviously, you meet a queue. You would have to join the queue. So come early if you know you want to use public because you will need to do prenatal and all those things. Come early to the country. Aside from that, um, they might be nice enough to give you some baby stuff, you know, baby clothing, baby food, baby beep, you know, just for like a month. Not that they will give you each day for a month. They will give you quantity that can last you for a month. I want to be making my videos very, very clear because it's like sometimes I get misunderstood and I won't want that to continue. So if you come from Nigeria or anywhere around the world to give birth in Brazil and you opt for private in, private hospital, be ready to pay whatever money that they say it is. Do you understand? Be ready to pay whatever money they call for you. Let me break it down for you like this. So in some hospitals, private hospitals, uh, you pay the hospital organization separately and you pay the gynecologist and his team separately. So like in an hospital, you can pay, hospital my, my request to pay 10,000 that you want to use their hospital, you pay 10,000 then the doctor that we that we help you deliver the baby for you successfully without any complications we we'll ask for almost 12 to fifteen thousand, depending on the quality of the private hospital some will ask for 15 20 30 plus that ten that the hospital is asking for you know, the system is different, yeah. So I don't know if it's the same way in Nigeria. Like, let's say, which hospital is popular? Maybe this uh, Richmond Hospital in Lake Abbey, I don't know the name. So if that hospital you get there, you want to give birth. The doctors that are working there are not working for the hospitals. For the hospital. The hospital itself is just a building. They are furnishing and all the hospital vibes and all those things. Then the doctor, the instrument, the nurse, the care assistant. I don't know if it's pedest pedestrian or <laughs> pedestrian or obstetrician or somebody that will assist the doctor hmm? in the whole betting process. The surgeon is up to 15. You know, those ones charge separately too. Hospital charge separate. Surgeon and his teams charge separate. If you cannot do it, don't double into it. I advise that if you cannot afford it, just quickly go to public. There's no need to spoil the country. There's no need to insult the country. There's no need to, you know, make funny, 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 funny gestures or, you know, calling the country some kind of names or, you know, all those funny, funny. You don't need it. 
let me also add that the prices for surgery if you need surgery is different from the sizes of natural prices of natural bed if you pay for natural beds and the mistakenly enter surgery it is another price again so be prepared you can just easily opt for private that's the one that government owns and is free the only thing that you might be paying for is maybe registration fee or something i'm not even registration fee maybe the agency you use because you're a foreigner you know well that's all that's all in public hospital so cut your coats according to your sizes do you get cut your coats according to your sizes the country is trying enough already they're doing so well already for themselves and for foreigners that intend to come so anyways i hope this video has been very educative for you if you have more questions i'm ready to answer them if you have anything you want to add anything you want me to make video on please don't forget to comment them under the comment section here yes so um thank you for your love and subscription thank you for this 1k once more i'm so grateful um anyways please do not forget to subscribe again if you haven't and like if you haven't and then share my videos thank you guys always for watching have a nice day like the color of my hair drop a love at shape in the comment section thank you